Daniela Keevan Williams' family says the incident began at that Shell gas station and then ended right here in this exact parking space. But they say what happened between those moments is still unclear. Very sad, unhappy, and hurt. Keevan Williams' mother, Abby Ward, says she doesn't know if her son will pull through a coma or ever walk again following an incident that happened here in this parking lot behind a Shell gas station on Greens Road. When I looked at him, they was like, he all messed up on, on his face and uh, swollen. Back on September 22nd, HCSO investigators say they were pursuing 42-year-old Williams, who had been arrested here before after spotting what seemed like a drug deal. He was advised that my brother um, was here at this location and he was running from the police and he was tased and he hit his head. Again, we're not exactly sure. My mom went there to um, see him at the hospital. It was, looked like it was something different. It was told to me that he was just uh, in a coma or something and we can't go up there to see him. Officials say Williams is in their custody, charged with evading arrest and trespassing. They also say they recovered marijuana from the scene. My brother, he's a loving person. He's funny. He has a sense of humor. Um, if you run across him, you're going to love him. He, I don't, I'm not saying he's the best child in the world, but he was my brother and I loved him. The family adds that even if an arrest was justified, they don't think that this should have happened. This was just like a, two low-level charges. So how can you have someone between the time that they were here to the time that they're at that hospital and you handcuffed to a bed fighting for your life? HCSO says William suffered those injuries after being tased and stumbling over a parking spot guard rail. His family wants the body cam footage released immediately. We're live in the Greenspoint area. Devin Clark, KPRC2 News.